Is this the place you spoke of? Yes. Deep within this grotto is where chaos is destined to awake. <laughs> Wait! Come on, Dr. Valentine! <laughs> the fountain isn't going anywhere. Don't you think you are taking things a little too quickly? And why not? All those people at Shinra who laughed at my thesis. I have to prove them wrong. Rushing into matters will get you nowhere, Doctor. Vincent Valentine reporting for duty, ma'am. I've been assigned your protection. No. Huh? Why would they... send his... Excuse me? Oh, oh, I apologize. This is the first time I have ever met anyone from the Turks. Lucrezia Crescent. Pleased to make your acquaintance, Mr. Valentine. Vincent. Vincent. Sleep here, and you might catch a cold. <laughs> Why are you so surprised? Is my face that hideous? No, I didn't. I'm sorry. And how are you supposed to be my bodyguard if you're up here sleeping? <laughs> the warm breeze. I was only going to rest my eyes for a minute. I have to admit, the breeze is quite comfortable. However, I think you're in my seat. Huh? <laughs> Care to join me? Lucrezia? Hello? Anybody here?
Crizia. I never blamed her. All I wanted was to see her smiling face. But after that day, the light left her heart. So you've come to your senses and chosen me. Yes. Doctor. However, if she is happy, then I don't mind. Is it true? Is what true? That Lucrezia, that Dr. Crescent is to take part in this project? It's true. Why are you so surprised? But using your own child for an experiment? Ha! I don't know what you're implying, but both of us are scientists. We know what we are doing. You are the last person to have any word in this. Now, leave us at once, boy. But... But what? <gasps> if you have something to say, say it. Are you... Are you sure this is what you really want? Am I sure? Am I sure? If this only concerns me, then yes, I am sure. Just... All I did was watch. I didn't even try to stop her. And then... you out.